And a pickup truck ran into a home overnight, and he had a good excuse. A man was trying to rob him. That armed man was hanging on to the truck. Saul is live in North Fort Worth. Yeah, pretty dramatic. Uh, we are actually at a T intersection, and unfortunately, this house here is uh, right at the end of that T. There's a street right in front of us here. Well, last night, uh, as you mentioned, there was a truck trying to escape a suspected carjacker. Well, they became, that truck came barreling down the street, slammed right into the house. It was just after 10 last night. Two men in that truck said, say that they were a couple of blocks away when a guy approached them with a knife and then tried to rob them, carjack them. The driver, though, uh, took off, the suspect clinging onto the side of the truck. When they got to the 3,000 block of Long Straw at that T intersection, the truck uh, kept on going, jumped the curb across the lawn and into the front of the house. Uh, the suspect, described as a guy in his late teens, was seriously hurt, taken to JPS Hospital at last check in critical condition. Uh, the two men in the truck were a bit shaken, but otherwise okay. The homeowners, meantime, we understand it's a young couple with a 15-month-old son. They were here at the time, but they were in the back of the uh, house, and so they were not hurt. But as you can see, uh, they do have a lot of cleaning up to do later on this morning. That's the latest here in Fort Worth. Saul Garza for Good Day.